Jacob Nolan's 13 and two on the season. This is our featured match of the night. WrestleStat has this as a really close bout. Jacob Nolan winning six to five as that's their prediction. Let's see what happens. And the lights will come back on and we'll get to wrestling. The bigger we get, the more thumps we hear with these boys. So we're up to 184 now, of course. Nolan just looked really dominating earlier today and also at Lehigh yesterday. Um, like I said, a questionable call there, you know, late in the match. Coach Stott's been saying everything right. Um, so, but Nolan's leading hard with his right leg. So, you know, obviously there's going to have to be a sequence where Chase can bring that, like, left leg forward. So if he's saying right, he needs that, that leg to come forward. I mean, and you need a reaction for that, of course, but, like, Good leg attack by Nolan. And he's he's where he wants to be on that knee. He's exactly where he wants to be. He needs to push over his foot here. This is great scrambling. Here's the takedown for three. Riding time starting to go up. 50, 50 seconds in the period. He's going for that far arm. Then he goes all over the, the far shoulder as well, which is exactly what you want to do. Krannitz with a heavy shoulder harness on. Um, those are not fun to wrestle with, of course, but you know, at the end of the day, Nolan's gonna finish his period on top. He's gonna be over a minute on the ride. This is how you want to end a first period against a really, really good opponent. You're up 3-0. You have the riding time advantage at the moment. So. Kranitz is only a redshirt freshman, as I've mentioned. And in high school, he was a three-time state qualifier. Really good high school state record, 118 and 33 in Pennsylvania, no less. Oh, that's what Nolan's been doing lately. He, he likes when guys apply that forward pressure, and then he does a really, really great job of stepping over, which, you know, some youth or high school coaches or junior high coaches might say that's dangerous. I view it as very exciting and, and great wrestling. Um, so at the end of the day, you guys that are listening out there and girls that are wrestling, just uh, do what makes you uh, most competitive and makes you enjoy the sport, right? So. Nolan's definitely at a different level right now as far as it just... You can just see it in his wrestling style. He he gets it. 
for sure. Like he gets it. Stotsman's telling Granites to, you know, kind of get out of ties with Nolan and, and like create space and like do what you need to do. Really good re attack there by Nolan. 20 seconds left in this period. 4 0, Nolan. 48 on the ride. So he's got a good front headlock on him, though. Oh, and Nolan tries to slip it. Kranitz does a good job reattacking, and this is close to three. <laughs> this is close. And he gets it. That's great wrestling by Nolan. I mean, you're, you're taking a guy that is a quality wrestler. You're up 7-0. You have 48 on the ride. I mean, you're definitely putting yourself in that major decision territory. Good leg attack by Granite. But they go out, but Kranitz did a, a perfect job there. Like, there's nothing that he didn't do that wasn't perfect. It's just he ran out of space, and these guys are getting bigger and bigger every weight class, so. He's going to chase the leg here. Beautiful job by Nolan, like. Get it. Hey, get up. Come on, Chase. Right here. Get one here. Chase, right here. Get one. Nolan's just dominating positions like the the, the further he gets into his college career, he just dominates positions. And it must just be <laughs> super fun for him being like, wow, when I was a freshman, I didn't know how to dominate that position now that I'm, you know, older and older and older. And there's a stall warning against Granite. But like, once I get more experience, I don't want to say older, but more experience, like these positions come a little more naturally to me, but it's only through hard work though. I mean, at the end of the day, like nothing comes easy in wrestling. And again, I go back to what Coach Borshoff says about him. They're like, he just keeps getting better every day. And there you go. 11-0, Jacob Nolan over our featured match of the night. I mean, he's on fire. He's so dedicated, he almost took his anklet, anklets off twice. Jacob Nolan. All right, guys. Well, we're coming into the big boys, 197, 285. When we come right back, you're watching ESPN+. Plus. <laughs> 